My name is Andrea Seabrook. I graduated in 1996. Uh, and I am here to give a convocation speech titled Why I Left the Best Job in Journalism. After leaving Earlham, I did a lot of things, but I ended up uh, at National Public Radio, NPR. And um, I ended up reporting for NPR. By the way, I was a bio major, so there's a lot you can do with an Earlham degree. Um, and uh, I covered Congress. So I came to a point where I said, this is not a service. I am doing a disservice by making myself a mouthpiece for them. And so I walked away. Um, I walked away from, I mean, people still think, some people still think I'm crazy. I've had a lot of success since, and I'm very lucky to have moved at the moment I did because I started a podcast. I had a Kickstarter campaign. I made $100,000 in three weeks. I started a show called Decode DC, um, which is really an attempt. A po it's just a podcast. It's like leaving the New York Times to start a blog. I left NPR to start a podcast. Um, but it, you know, it's an attempt to tell the real stories, everything that isn't talked about in the news. And it's exactly the values of Earlham um, that taught me, that gave me the fortitude to say no. I, I get so much accolade. I mean, people still think of me as the former NPR correspondent, you know, like as if I haven't done anything since. Because it's so huge. I mean, the... The pressure to stay in such a high status job is enormous, but not as strong ultimately as the pull of the values that I gained at Earlham um, to do it better. And at Earlham, even if your major is biology, you can minor in Latin American lit and work at the radio station and, and sing and go to Mexico and, and, uh, and be in the play. And it, it was just, it's just, brilliant. It's just the right way to do a well-rounded, um, broad, liberal, and I mean that in the classical sense, uh, education that, that teaches you the rigor and the writing that you need to go forward.